Hey everyone, this is Han in the Wind. How is everybody doing today? Hope everybody is having a great day today. Uh, today I'm going to show you guys how to use the most up-to-date DoorDash driver app. Okay, so hopefully this video is going to help you guys out and uh, get you guys a little familiar with it. So that way you guys can uh, start dashing. All right, so uh, first things first, you want to download the, the uh, Dasher app. As you can see in my screen here, there's the Dasher app right there. I'm going to go ahead and tap on that. So once you tap on it, you're going to sign in. And this is how it's going to look like. Okay, guys. Um, right now seems pretty busy. As you can see on the screen, it's, uh, it's a bunch of red... Uh, you know a lot of red spots there so when it's red um it's usually very very busy and if it says very busy it means it's pretty busy okay so today uh the main focus is to show you guys how to schedule a dash in advance and also i'm also going to show you guys how to uh cancel that schedule if you decide you know you don't have time to do it all right and then lastly I'm going to show you guys how to dash now. All right. So if you look in the bottom, they have that dash now icon in the bottom. But I'm going to show you that uh, last. Okay. So what we're going to do now is just play around with the Dasher app real quick before I go into detail on how to uh, schedule a dash. All right. So um, if you guys can see, uh, moving it around here. And if you look inside the, the app, you see that little blinking um, blue dot. That's just indicating that um that's where I'm at, um, just to let you know basically let you know where you're at and what area is busy if you decide you want to go or, you know go to a certain area, but uh, most of the time I just stay in the area that I'm at so that way you know I make the most time uh, you know most efficient maximize my uh, time and income okay so I just stay one spot I don't want to go around and uh, you know waste all that time so. Uh, but uh, I'm not going to talk about uh, how to uh, maximize your income and, um, and time in this video. Uh, this video is just to show you how to use the app, all right? So if you look down, there is uh, five, uh, I would say, icon. Um, it's going to say Dash, Schedule, Account, Ratings, and Earnings, okay? So uh, dash basically is just the front of the screen what uh, that you're seeing right now. Schedule is what we're gonna be going in uh, in a little bit here, and account just basically has your name and phone number. Rating is just the ratings of uh, you know all your deliveries and people what people rate you, and earning is just what you get paid. Okay, so um, but I'm gonna focus only on the schedule today. So let's go ahead and uh, if you had, you guys have, uh, go ahead and tap on the schedule icon at the bottom for me. And once you uh, tap on the schedule, it's going to show you a little calendar, okay? So as you can see, um, Friday the 13th, which is today, all the way to uh, Thursday the 19th, okay? All the way to next week. So let's, uh, for instance, you want to schedule for Monday the 16th. Okay, let's do Monday. Go ahead and tap on Monday, guys. Okay, once you tap on Monday, it's going to tell you the availability, you know, the available time available for you to start scheduling that dash. All right, so right now I'm in San Jose. So I'm going to do like a real schedule so that way you guys can see uh, how I do it. And I believe San Jose is all the way in the bottom here. Let me just scroll down here. Um, let me see if I did I pass it. Uh, let's see. Let's go back up real quick. All right. So it looks like. Trying to look for San Jose now. I thought usually it's all the way in the bottom. But I guess it's not. Um, I'm assuming if it doesn't have it, that means it's uh, pretty booked or so. Let's um, go ahead and click on the 19th. Thursday on the 19th. Let's see if we have any available slot. It doesn't have anything. 
So it tells you right there that there's no available slot, so you can't schedule the dash. Let's try Wednesday the 18, and let's see if we have uh, San Jose or not. If we don't have San Jose, I'm just going to choose a different city. So that way you guys know how to uh, schedule that dash, okay? But let me go ahead and find that San Jose real quick. Because since I'm in San Jose, I want to show you. Okay, there it is, guys. We do have a San Jose right there. If you can see, it says 12 a.m. to to 12 a.m. next day. Go ahead and tap on that. And once we tap on that, when you want to schedule a dash, it's saying that you can schedule between 12 a.m. and 12 a.m., basically 24 hours, I guess. Um, go ahead and start. Let's tap on the start time. And let's just say, for instance, you want to start at uh, noontime on Wednesday, the 18. Okay. Go ahead and press done at noon. And then you want to end, you want to dash for, let's say, three hours, okay, that day. Let's go ahead and put PM here. Okay, it's not, okay. There we go. We're going to go all the way to, uh, let's go back to Wednesday because it was Wednesday. So, we're going to go ahead and do to 3 PM, okay. Somehow it's not allowing me here, but here it is. All right, so we're going to go ahead and, and uh, dash into... 3 p.m. on Wednesday, okay? So we're going to start at 12 p.m. and end on 3 p.m. So what you want to do now is you want to save that dash. On the bottom, you're going to see that, okay? Go ahead and tap on that. And once you tap on the save dash, you're going to see right there it says uh, San Jose from 12 uh, p.m. to 3 p.m. on Wednesday the 18th, okay? So you're going to see that schedule dash, okay? Uh, if you do more, you're going to see more. But I'm just going to do one because it's pretty straightforward. You know, it's all the same. Um, okay, so what happened if, let's just say, you know, on Thursday, on M Monday or Tuesday, and you're like, uh, you know, I got something to do and I can't uh, do that dash, right? So what you can do is you can actually actually edit it for another time or you can just uh, cancel, cancel that dash, okay? Um, I'm going to show you guys how to cancel the dash. So what you want to do is tap on that schedule time right there, the kind of light bluish color. Go ahead and tap on that. And once you tap on that, you see it's it's the same screen, but when you look on the top right, you're going to see it says delete. You guys see that? So go ahead and tap on delete. And once you tap on the delete button, everything is deleted. All right, guys. So right now you have no schedule dash, and that is exactly how you schedule a dash and cancel a dash. Okay, so... You know, you want to do that so that way you can give the uh, those times to uh, other dasher. All right? Um... So, yeah, so hopefully you guys understand how to do that. Uh, if you guys have any questions, leave it down below, okay, so I can help you guys out. And uh, the last but not least is I'm going to show you guys how to dash now. And dash now is what I like to do, okay. I don't really like to schedule or cancel the dash you know, in advance. I just like to dash now because, um, you know, I want to do it whenever I feel like it because I have another job. So, um, I basically do DoorDash part-time, so... Whenever I'm free, I just, you know, go into the Dasher app and just dash whenever whenever it's convenient for me. All right. So let's go back outside to the Dasher app. So on the bottom, you want to click on that dash button, okay, or the icon on the bottom. And then once you uh, click on that icon, you're going to go back into the front of the screen. You see that right now? Like we were discussing earlier how it's pretty busy right now. You get a two dollar bonus right there on uh, san jose or if you go up a little bit up north it's five dollar and then to the left wow santa clara i believe is six dollars all right so if you go toward those area each dash they give you an additional you know five or six dollars so let's say if they pay you um six dollar for the dash and then you complete that dash that bonus right there that you see this the five dollar bonus then that means it adds to it okay so you get eleven dollars for one dash which is actually pretty good all right but anyway look all the way to the bottom it's going to say dash now so that's what i usually do um and it does have in my area two dollar bonus peak pay until 10 30. so what you want to do is tap on dash now and once you tap on dash now it's going to ask you how long you want to dash you see that so for instance let's say I'll, i want to dash into uh, 10 p.m all right 
And then once you tap on 10 p.m., I mean, tap on uh, dash on the, the bottom, uh, the red button on the bottom, it's going to ask you, uh, make sure you're ready for your dash, okay? So you got to click on charge phone. Uh, you got to click on enough gas, red card, hot bag, and a space blanket, okay? So um, before you start dashing, you got to get all these things ready, all right? So like I was saying on my, um, my other uh, DoorDash video, uh, when I have a, a video on how to be uh, a successful DoorDash driver, when you guys have a chance, uh, go ahead and watch that video, okay? It's going to be in my, you know, the video before this one. All right, but I'm not going to do a dash right now. I just wanted to show you guys how to just do that dash now, which is pretty straightforward. Uh, most of the time, my area is pretty busy. So that's the reason why I don't really schedule a dash. And I already set it as dash. So let me go ahead and delete this dash real quick here because that because it's thinking that I'm going to be dashing right now. So uh, I went ahead and delete that. All right. So, uh, yeah, I mean, that's about it. And uh, let me show you just a little bit more here. They changed the at the the DoorDash app a little bit here. Um, if you look on top, there's going to be a bell and a promo. Okay, so if you click on a bell, let's go ahead and do that. It's going to say, um, you know, basically the bell will just give you updates. All right, so it says if you refer a friend, it'll give you a certain amount of a bonus. Okay, and it got some enhanced security. Never show, uh, share your DoorDash password and stuff like that. So whenever they have a breaking news or any new news, uh, it's going to be on that bell. All right. And then go ahead toward the right. There's going to be promos. We go and go ahead and click on that. And promo is just basically letting you know ahead of time um, what the bonus would be. And right now it says uh, in Milpitas, you get a dollar bonus, all right, from uh, 648 to 848, which is only a few minutes later. Um, and then you keep going down. It looks like, it, you know, it has bonuses on uh, Saturday and stuff like that. So you can see ahead of time. And and the difference between this app versus the, the previous app, like about six months ago, they don't have this, um, this update where you can see these bonuses ahead of time, okay? Now they allow you to see it and they also allow you to schedule ahead of time. So that way you're, you're I guess you're guaranteed to work it during that shift and get that bonus. But, you know, in my experience, you know, there's in my experience and in my area, it seems like there's always it's always busy. So that's why I really never uh, schedule a dash. Like, for instance, right now, like I was telling you, if you look down, you see it says dash now and they give me a two dollar bonus if I were if I were to dash right now because it's just way too busy right now. All right, guys, so that is about it on how to use the uh, most updated DoorDash driver app. And I just wanted to show you the basics, okay, on how to schedule a dash, cancel that dash, and dash now, all right? So if you guys have any questions or comment, go ahead and leave them down below. If you guys haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button, okay? Because I'm going to have a lot more videos on DoorDash and a bunch of other videos about my life. And um, you don't want, you guys don't want to miss out, all right? So with that being said, uh, thanks a lot for watching. And I hope this uh, tutorial will help you guys out. And uh, that's it. You guys have a great day and have a great weekend. Take care of yourself. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.